Hello and welcome to Maths with Jacob. This lesson will focus on square and triangle numbers. Square numbers. The square numbers are 1, 4, 9, 16, 25, 36 and so on. The square numbers are generated as follows. The first square number is 1, which is 1 squared. The second square number is 4, which is 2 squared. The third square number is 9, which is 3 squared. The fourth square number is 16, which is 4 squared. So basically you have 1 squared, 2 squared, 3 squared, 4 squared, 5 squared, 6 squared, etc, etc. Images for square numbers. Now when we write or represent the square numbers in the form of a diagram, each of them looks like a square. And that makes sense. 4 squared is 4 by 4. 3 squared is 3 by 3. Hence they're in the form of a square. Let's look at some questions. Question 1. What is the sum of the first three square numbers? The solution. The sum equals 1 squared plus 2 squared plus 3 squared which is 1 plus 4 plus 9 and that's 14. What is the product of the second and third square numbers? Solution. Product means multiplication. So the second square number is 2 squared. The third square number is 3 squared. 4 times 9, that gives you 36. What is the positive difference between the fourth and fifth square numbers? Positive difference means that the answer is a positive number. So we have to put the large one first. So we have 5 squared minus 4 squared, because it's the fifth, minus the fourth. 25 minus 16 is 9. Question 4. Divide the sixth square number by the second square number. The sixth square number is 6 squared. The second square number is 2 squared. 36 divided by 4 is 9. Let's look at triangle numbers. The triangle numbers are 1, 3, 6, 10, 15 and so on. The triangle numbers are generated as follows. The first one is 1. The second one is 1 plus 2 which is 3. The third one is 1 plus 2 plus 3 which is 6. The fourth one is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 which is 10 and so on. So here are some images for the triangle numbers and you can see they look like triangles. Now let's look at some questions on triangle numbers. What is the sum of the third and fifth triangle numbers? So we have 6 plus 15 and that gives us 21. What is the product of the second and fourth triangle numbers? 3 times 10 gives you 30 because product means multiplication. Question 3. What is the positive difference between the 7th and 5th triangle numbers? That's 28 minus 15 and that gives you 13. Divide the 6th triangle number by the 2nd triangle number. So that's 21 divided by 3 and that gives you 7. So this video has looked at the idea of square numbers and triangle numbers. We've seen how each of those are generated and we've done a few exercises on each.